What's up everybody? This is Henry from the PSI Defense Channel coming to you with another video and my endeavors to offer more content to you guys uh, instead of just the occasional gun testing video I'm going to do an unboxing video today as you see I got a goodie box from SSD uh, this is my order, it's not a sponsor video I buy my parts just like you guys do uh, Sterling was very proud of this box he sent to me. You know, he's a recycler. He does his part for the environment, but uh, so those cool little gadgets he's always going on about, about how to keep your stuff organized and get your tools and stuff together, magnetic, such and such. But right on, go environment. But without further ado, let's get into my little package here before I cut my finger off. with my super sharp hard carbine steel florist knife. Alrighty. Hopefully everything is in frame and you guys can see this. Alright, these are awesome. This is an SSD. I think it's called a power block. I'm not sure what it is. It's an ASA. Of course, everything from SSD is CNC machined. This is an ASA with a body cap. Uh, and since I have my own brand new proprietary um, on-off system going on my launchers here pretty soon, um, I don't need the first strike on-off. That little knob here, which is actually useless for high power, um, is not involved in this build here, which is going to be great. Looking forward to this. Um, I'm going to be fixing the return stinger and putting that up for sale very soon with the uh, next generation on and off. It's going to be awesome. You guys are going to love it. Foolproof. Wait till you guys see it. That's going to be the next video because now that my SSD stuff's here, I'm going to build it. A couple of these, some metal detents. Guys, I hear a lot of you guys crying about how much Sterling charges for these. These are five bucks a piece from Pepperball. Can't be nothing about that. All right. All the bags, SSD mags. Needed some of these, so. Go ahead and order them. This is actually the first time I've gotten a hold of Sterling's mags. I've had uh, Grimberg mags, which always work pretty great. Uh, I gotta say, this is pretty sweet looking. Very great CNC milling, smooth action. I might drop a little oil on that, but other than that, it feels very stable. Probably another mag, I'm sure. Yep, boom. Sterling. There's more stuff in here, but let's get to these. These must be the SSD barrels. Highly recommended. This here is a dual channel, which means it can fit in an FSC and a VKS. Very awesome. Comes with metal detents. Installed. Yeah, that's great. That's a great feat of engineering, if I do say so myself. I hate to give them props, but that's a great invention. Not that he doesn't deserve credit for these this amazing stuff that he builds, but it goes to his head, so I like to try to keep him humble. All right, here is a uh, FSC barrel. I ordered several barrels for some builds that I'm working on. There's that. And another FSC VKS combo barrel. All right, there's all the barrels. Right, let's see what's in this little box here. Probably detents or something. Oh, nice. Ooh, nice touch, Sterling. SSD comp. Kind of like that. He's printing on bamboo printers. Very strong. 
very stable print SSD branding on there that's a good touch brother oh yeah didn't want one of these too slim body cap look at that guaranteed not to blow up and take a chunk out of your sternum or your abdomen rather yeah really like that Cerakoted. All right. SSD printed detents next to metal. These are the next best thing. I have yet to break one of these or shear one of these off. They, they last a long time. Let's see what we got here. Oh yeah. Another compensator for an upcoming build I have planned. Yes, sir. That's going to be dope. Can't wait to do that one. And last but not least. All right. Another long compensator because I just sold the FSC, the one that I, on my last video. Uh, where it had a boom treated T8.1 barrel fit perfectly in an, in a FSC with uh, one of these compensators in it. So glad I ordered another one because I'm out and that's a really great package. I've got several other T8.1 barrels hanging around. I got 50 joules out of that package. So here is another long compensator. I think this is the large and this is the medium compensator that he has. These are really strong, printed very well. Yeah, not mad at all about these. I've been telling Danny he needs to put SSD on a lot of his stuff. Glad to see he's finally done it. Yeah, he's got a laser, laser forge. I think he said laser forge his barrels also. Uh, drop a comment in there and tell me what you think about that. Maybe we can get him to start doing that as well. All right, and uh, that's my goodie box. Plenty of stuff here for my new builds, especially I can't wait to uh, show you guys what I'm going to do with these and my new proprietary on off. Um, yeah, very excited about those builds. Uh, and, you know, the only other thing I got to say, guys, is, um, you know, for some odd reason, uh, you guys know that uh, Sterling and I are friends. You know, uh, we, we support one another's business. We have been uh, uh, compatriots of Less Lethal for a number of years now. We've been doing trades since before either one of us started selling anything. Before either one of us had YouTube channels. Uh, so, you know, I, I deal with Sterling. You know, I agree with some of the stuff he's about. I don't agree with some other stuff he's about. But one thing for sure, he's a straight up business person. Quality, he stands behind his work. Just like, just like myself. So, you know, him and I, we focus on what we have in common rather than what we disagree on. And, uh, but unfortunately, we tend to run into customers that have unrealistic expectations of what they feel that they can get from a less lethal custom builder. Now me, I'm more of a niche builder. Uh, Sterling, he's more of an established large business. He's retired, so this is his primary uh, his primary business other than uh, you know the projects and various things he does around his property. Uh, for me, you know my primary business is the floral industry. And this is a side business, and I'm more of a niche, uh, a niche builder. I would do more custom builds and packages, and I use uh, the best products that I found through testing um, to uh, do that. So either way, custom builds and custom launchers and custom repairs, they do take time. Uh, we can't snap our fingers and just get this stuff. Some of these items I ordered a while ago, but he's been waiting for, he waits for things like aluminum. Uh, for, for like these end caps. Sometimes he uh, has to replace tools on a CNC machine. Sometimes first strike is backed up on parts. So, you know, if you've ordered something and we have to wait for parts, well, we have to wait for that to come in. When the parts come in, now we have to wait for things to clear up to where we can complete your build. Uh, we've never failed to deliver an item. So guys, just be patient. I mean, the supply chain is still kind of uh, what it is. We're at the whims of that. So, just like ordering things from anywhere else, when you order from us, 
uh, we're not Amazon. We can't deliver in uh, a day or two. Uh, so just be reasonable. Um, if you uh, decide to be reasonable and work with us on repairing your stuff, well, that's fine as well. But if you want to be like one of these guys who's reversing credit card charges or filing PayPal claims fraudulently, that, that's fine. Hey, if you want to get your money back like that, that's okay. But just realize now you're on the blacklist for both Sterling and myself. You know, I'm not going to deal with anybody who has uh, screwed him over and he's not going to deal with anybody that has screwed me over. You know, and, uh, you know, we stand up and we we do honorable business with the less lethal community. Uh, we've, we've proven ourselves to be here to help everybody. Uh, but like I said, a lot of people, they have unrealistic expectations of what they should be, what they should have, uh, what they should be able to do. A lot of times people get these launchers and they're working perfectly and they obviously break them and we won't bend over backwards to help them fix them, but we will help them fix them. But when it's not to their satisfaction, even though they broke it, you know, they do they do other things that are malicious ways to get their funds back and so forth and so on. We can't help that. But what we can tell you is uh, if that's the route you choose to go, then uh, you no longer have access to 80 joule stingers and Sterling's 100 joule uh, rifles and, and uh, quality built VKSs that get uh, more than 80 joules. And, you know, all that kind of great stuff that we have. Both him and I are both uh, pepper ball and first strike dealers. He's a UTG dealer. He's got access to all kinds of stuff. We get our hands on all kinds of stuff and we have access to all kinds of stuff. If you guys want to be malicious and uh, backdoor, get your money back. And instead of trying to be reasonable and work with us, allow us to make the uh, whatever situation is right. Um, that's your choice to do. But just know that if you go that route, then you're uh, at the mercy of people who either A, sell unmodified guns with uh, accessories attached to them or guns that would that have uh, air chamber extensions that will blow up and put holes in your back. Um, uh, people with uh, claim numbers that they don't get. You know, there's a lot of people out there that sell on snake oil, you know, and printed parts and springs that, that fail. You know, uh, we are, yeah, sometimes the stuff that Sterling and I sell costs more, but we actually use the official stuff. You know, we don't go find cheap Chinese springs just because it's a stronger spring and then it's going to eventually fail. We actually use the pepper ball springs because pepper ball has done the math. There's, there's a fine balance between spring tension and it's all in the timing. The way these blow forward systems work, it's, it's valve timing is what is getting you the power. So, uh, you know, for people who have been dealing with us for years and have been enjoy enjoying our level of service and craftsmanship and knowledge, uh, they realize that, you know, there's no substitute. They're, they're going to get what they need. Everything is going to be great. Everything is going to flow nicely. Um, there's also people who have, you know, not been so good as far as customers and they found out that, hey, you know, I, I tried to get over on them and now I don't have access to things like SSD barrels or uh, my on off uh, buff and polish or, you know, my, my VKS mods. You know, you can get VKSs, but none of them are shooting 80 jewels or, or Sterling's mods. And, you know, it's completely up to you. Either way, you know, it leaves a bad taste in our mouths, but we're going to continue to keep going and we're going to continue to keep service in the less lethal community. You just won't be a part of our customer base anymore, which if that's OK with you, that's OK with us, too. But, you know, what goes around comes around and you really shouldn't do business like that. So, uh, you know, I just, you know, I, it, it sometimes gets discouraging, makes, you know, makes me want to stop selling and stop doing those things, stop making these builds and, you know, all that. But don't worry about it, guys. I started uh, PSI Defensive Solutions to help people that was in a similar situation as myself. Either you cannot own, legally own firearms or you do not want to have firearms uh, to protect your house because if you shoot somebody in your house, you got to worry about what's behind them, what's who's outside the house, on the other side of the wall. If you, if you discharge a firearm in your house, there's a potential to go through a wall and hit one of your own loved ones. So some people don't like firearms in the house. Sometimes your wife may not be comfortable with you having a gun. But a CO2 or compressed air um, launcher is a little bit more reasonable. So uh, that that's what I'm here for. That's what we're here for. That's what we're endeavoring to do to help to push the bounds to to make 
reliable products, power modifications that actually are effective and are actually reliable. So, you know, uh, that, that's my soapbox for today. I'm done ranting. Just wanted to put out a video, you know, hopefully you guys enjoyed my unboxing. Um, hopefully you guys, uh, you know, heard what I said, maybe take heed to some I said, see some of the quality that Sterling's putting out. You guys know the quality that I'm putting out with my launchers, but uh, yeah, that, that's enough ranting. I'm gonna go ahead and build these guns up and, uh, you know, get ready for Turkey Day. Hope you guys enjoy Thanksgiving with your families. Um, if not, you know, everybody doesn't have somewhere to, to uh, have a big, huge gathering and a meal, but you definitely have something to be thankful for. You know, I know every day that God gives us on this earth is a gift. So I hope you guys take advantage of it. Hope you guys show some love to one another and show some respect. Today, Henry, PSI Defense Channel, signing out. Happy Thanksgiving, y'all. Peace.